Uh, uh, thank you, thank you. Today we are hosting the uh, chairman for the EACC and the other commissioners and the Central Rift office. That is the regional office for the Central Rift. And so today the commission is on a tour to sensitize the public and the public officers elected leaders on the importance of promoting integrity in our spaces and everywhere that we work, everywhere that we walk, and in everything that we do. And so uh, the County Assembly of Nakuru, it's a major stakeholder in the fight against corruption and also in as far as promoting integrity is concerned in our county. And so today we are here and we want to welcome the chair to give a brief and to address us briefly on their visit to this uh, county. Karibu sana, buona chair. Thank you. Uh, thank you, Mr. Speaker, uh, for the opportunity as our speaker has mentioned today, as ESCC, we came to visit uh, this region. Uh, we have 11 regions across the country where the uh, Ethics and Anti-Corruption Commission operates, and one of them is uh, hosted here in Nakuru, and therefore we came to just uh, visit uh, this region and see the work that they are doing. A key stakeholder in any county is their county assembly because they play the oversight role of uh, the county and how the resources within the county are utilized. And uh, therefore, we, our partnership with the county assembly is so important. And today we were privileged and honored to uh, address the county assembly and share thoughts and ideas on how they can uh, help facilitate oversight, ensuring that the resources that have been allocated to the county government are properly utilized for the purposes for which they have been allocated. And them as a, a county assembly, it is their role to ensure that that happens and where there are any breaches, they can uh, deal with those and also in where necessary, uh, call the ESCC in to come and see what actually might be going on. And so we have had a very good discussion and we have encouraged uh, ourselves that we are going to uh, work even more collaboratively to ensure that the county assembly, or rather the county of Nakuru, uh, operates within the ethical standards. This is a county that has been known for great work. Uh, for a long time, this town was known as the cleanest in, in Kenya, and we want it to be also the cleanest in matters of ethics and integrity so that uh, it can set an example for other counties. And it is very possible. Devolution is one of the best things that happened to our country. Our resources are brought down to the grassroots. Unfortunately, we have seen a situation where a few individuals have decided to uh, privatize the resources that have been brought to the county level uh, for their own personal use. And therefore, the Kenyans are not benefiting fully from this uh, devolution idea because the resources are uh, not getting down to them, services are not getting down to them. But we believe that if the county assembly uh, plays its oversight role correctly and uh, com uh, collaborates together with us in ESCC, uh, we can see better fruit uh, of the devolution process 
and resources being utilized to benefit Kenyans in every way. So we want to thank uh, our Mr. Speaker for allowing us to address uh, his members and for the discussions that we have had. We believe that we are going to work together going forward to ensure that this county becomes a shining star among the counties of Kenya. Thank you. The report of the Auditor General uh, every year is one of the sources of uh, information as to uh, cases that we investigate. So you can be sure that those reports that have been uh, flagged by the, the projects that have been flagged by the Auditor General, we are certainly going to look into them and see wha what happened, uh, who are involved and those people who are culpable be brought to book so that they can answer to whatever they did. But uh, indeed, the reports of the Auditor General uh, form uh, the core part of the work that we do. Thank you. Asante Nisana, thank you very much. Thank you.